If you need to send an Illustrator file to someone, maybe so they can work on it or print it, there are certain things that need to be sent along with the file. In this video, you'll explore packaging an Illustrator document using the package command. If you want to follow along, open this practice file from the downloadable practice files for this tutorial. When you open this practice file, you may see the missing fonts dialog box since this file uses a typekit font. Access to the Adobe Typekit font library is included with your Adobe Creative Cloud membership. If you do see the dialog box, click Sync Fonts to fix the missing font. When the font is synced, you can click Close. To see the whole design, choose View, Fit Artboard and Window. If you place images into an Illustrator project and they're linked to an original image file, you'll need to send the original image along with the Illustrator file you send someone. Select the selection tool in the Tools panel on the left and select this image of water. You can tell that this image is linked to an image outside of Illustrator because in the Properties panel to the right of the document, you can see Linked File at the top of the panel. If you apply a font to text that another user may not have in their machine, you'll need to send a copy of the font file along with the Illustrator file as well. You won't need to send any Typekit fonts you use in your project. Luckily, you don't have to gather all these files yourself. Illustrator has a command called package. When you package a file, Illustrator creates a folder that contains a copy of the Illustrator document, any necessary fonts, linked graphics like this image, and a package report. The report, which is a text file, includes information about the packaged files. So you can package this project, which uses a Typekit font and a linked image. Choose File, Package. If you're prompted to save the file, click Save. In the package dialog box, click the folder icon to choose where to create the folder. I'll place it on my desktop and click Choose. A folder will be created for you. You can change the name of the folder here. I'll simply remove the word folder. All of the links in the document will be found and copied into the folder it creates. Any fonts used in this document will be copied and placed in that folder as well, except for Chinese, Japanese, Korean, and Typekit fonts. When another user opens this file in Illustrator, they'll be prompted to sync any Typekit fonts used, like you saw in the beginning. Click Package to package the files, and then click OK. After the package is created, you can click Show Package if you want to see the folder. In the folder, you'll see the copy of the Illustrator document and all of the links, including the image. I'll click OK. Now you know how to send someone an Illustrator file, ensuring that they have everything they need to edit or print the document. You can now package your own Illustrator files, maybe to send to a printer or to send to a coworker, or maybe even use as a method for collecting all the files used in an Illustrator document so you can archive the project. You can close this file without saving it by choosing File, Close.